Hi, my name is Jennifer Crane, and I'm here with IDA TV at the opening night of Wash Your Dryer at East West Players with Rachna Cattell. How's it going? <laughs> it's going great, thank you. Very well, I must say that was a fantastic play. You did amazing. Thank you so much, it was a blast. So how did you get involved with this play first off? I came in for an audition, just like, you know, any other job. And um, it was, when I got the script, it was so funny that I was like, ooh, I kind of, you know, really, I'd love to do this. But um, having the opportunity has just been a blast. I've loved it. Now, do you usually play roles like this? Or are they more, um, like, like, sad or scary? I mean, this is very, this is hilarious, I must ask. I love comedy. I definitely, that's kind of where I live. I do a lot of sketch and improv and, and just comedy in general. So um, the opportunity to do a comedy at, you know, at this caliber, at this level, um, and play a romantic lead at the same time was, was new, but awesome. So fun. So talk to me about that romantic lead. Was it kind of awkward first getting into it with Michael? Or? No, you know, Ewan, the actor who plays my husband, is fantastic. He's so talented and he's so professional and just sweet and respectful and kind and awesome in every way. So um, there was never a moment of awkwardness or uncomfortableness. It was just, there was a lot of trust and it just, it, it was very organic. Definitely. And I noticed that you went to USC and you had a master's in broadcast journalism. So how does that help you with your career now? Did it go as planned? You know, um, the broadcast journalism was something I always loved doing, and it's what got me out to Los Angeles. So I'm forever grateful for that, and I loved going to USC, and I met amazing people there. Um, but my passion really was always acting, and that was just kind of my excuse to get me to Los Angeles. <laughs> But I learned so much and I still love it. I love interviewing people. I love telling people stories. And I think that's where the overlap is in telling stories, telling your own stories, meeting people, telling their stories, telling stories that other people write. Um, and so I think the, the all-encompassing thing is that I'm a storyteller. I agree with that, that's for sure. And okay, and one more question for you. Um, did you choose the play specifically because it had to deal with culture and like Asian Americans, especially since you played um, an Indian woman? Um, how does that relate to you, what you want to do and your culture? You know, the fact that Nandita, the playwright, wrote this with such a diverse cast in mind was such a gift. It's not something that you get to do all the time. It's not something that you see out there. Um, I go out on auditions for a lot of sidekick, best friend, funny characters, and I love playing characters. I love doing comedy, but the opportunity to play a romantic lead in a comedy as an Indian woman is not something that, you know, my door's not being banged down for that. So it was, it was a, a wonderful opportunity, and it was challenging, but it was, it's been um, such a gift. It's been such an honor to get to do it, and I'm, I'm very, very grateful to her and to Peter and to East West Players. Well, thank you so much. We're grateful to have you here. Thank you. It's been so much fun. Thank you. I'm Jennifer Crane, and I'm with IDA TV.